quintuplets. A quintuplet is what it sounds like, a group of five notes. But in music, it means more than that. When we beam five notes together and call them a tuplet, what that means is that it's a set of five notes that fit into the space of four notes within a simple meter's big beat, or even into the space of three notes if we're in a compound meter where every big beat contains three little beats, like 6, 8, 12, 8, and so on. So in the example above, these are quintuplet quavers meant to fit into the space of four quavers. That means that in this bar, whatever the meter is, this quintuplet will take the same amount of time to play as four quavers or one minim. So each one of these quintuplet quavers is a little faster than a normal quaver in this tempo. Here's a comparison between a quintuplet and a normal beat division in both simple meter and compound meter. Notice that in 2-4, the quintuplet takes up four semiquavers worth of space, and it has a semiquaver beam. But in 6-8, it takes up three quavers and has a quaver beam. In both cases, the quintuplet fills up one big beat within its time signature. One way you can help yourself play or sing quintuplets evenly is to think of the words university or hippopotamus with each note in the quintuplet getting one syllable. Sextuplets. Sextuplets are groups of six notes that are usually meant to fit into where you'd normally have four notes given the meter. If you're only taking the speed and not the accent pattern into account when you play, you can even think of sextuplets as two sets of triplets beamed together. This only works musically if you're accenting it like one, two, three, four, five, six, though. Not one, two, three, four, five, six. Sextuplets can be accented both ways, so you'll have to decide which way is best for the piece you're playing. Here's a crotchet sextuplet set against four normal crotches and accented like it's two pairs of triplets in a drum pattern. And here is a crotchet sextuplet set against four normal crotchets, again, but accented differently, like it's three sets of two notes within that sextuplet. So you'll think one, two, three, four, five, six. Here's how they may look in a musical context. As with the quintuplets, they're contrasted with normal note values within each big beat. Mm -hmm. 